Triple G is slow and he doesn't react like he used to, maybe the 36-year-old, and, and it's more of his style. It's more of his style. But he's always dangerous. He's always dangerous, Triple G. Got to get up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, know, you, you know how you sound, right? You know how you sound. Because I've known you for years, B-Hop. You know how you sound. You sound like you're trying to say Triple G going to get knocked out. That's what I hear coming out of your mouth. Is that what you're saying? No. He going to get finesse. Okay. Finessinism. He going to get that. Finessinism. Listen, That's a new one. Listen, That's a new one. Go listen, ahead. Go ahead. He's going to get one right. of these grade book grades. He's going to do what you did to Kelly Pavlik? You talking like that? That lesson that you gave, and I love Kelly Pavlik. I got a better Until one. he went up against you. I got a better one. Is that what you're saying? No. What? Tito Trinidad. Really? Well, Tito. But he won't but get you, knocked but out. But you finished Trinidad. You finished but Trinidad. He won't get, uh, but he won't get knocked out. Triple G will not get knocked out. He'll but just he get scored. Trinidad, Trinidad got knocked out in the 12th round because I just said, I just thought the scorecards might have been a little different if they read them. Okay. That, that wow. motivated that, me to get it out. Okay. Got it. But. Right. But it would be that type of beatdown where you would say, I got to catch him with B Hop before he leave Vegas because this was a, he won nine rounds out of 12. And, and, and this where, look, Canelo's going to get out first that he didn't do the first fight. Let Triple G, the puncher, let him try to play catch up and be in a position he'd never been in before. Let Canelo now get five rounds up on him or four, maybe one or two even if it goes in the seventh or eighth round, and let Triple G. Look for that home run that never comes. So you don't to clear the bases, okay. which is the grand slam if he do it. Okay. But he won't be able to do it. All right, we're talking to the great Bernard Hopkins, former undisputed middleweight champion of the world, right here with Stephen A. on ESPN Radio, ESPN News. Oscar, along with others, swear there's real animosity between these two. That Canelo is highly offended. That Triple G complained. That they blame Triple G in his camp for stalling the first fight. Uh, Canelo is saying that. Triple G is attacking his character. He's offended by that, and he really, really wants to knock him out. How you sound is Canelo's going to get into the ring. He's going to be smarter than that, and he's not going to put himself in front of Triple G and try to trade with him or anything like that. Not he's early. just going to finesse Not him. early. Okay. Not early. Let him spend some bullets. Let him, win. Let him spend some bullets. He's going to shoot. Let him go ahead and get frustrated. No, see, we got the better all-around fighter. Triple G is a guy that has good – and great attributes, but it's less than five, right? And we know by his, box, his knockout ratio what that is. So other than that, he moves slow. He don't have a quick response, especially now, based on the last fight. And a lot of it he might have against somebody else. Mm. But against Canelo, Canelo made him look, even though he might not have been then, but going to make him look old come Saturday on HBO and Baby you're Bill. really convinced it's good for him to have lost weight. Yeah. You the, really feel that way. Listen, the lighter in this situation, the better. Because muscle gets tired. When you swing and miss and you balked up, most of the weightlifting guys got five seconds before they start breathing and then the fight's over. They got to grab you and throw you down. Look in the streets. Same thing in high school. Same thing in college. Being big doesn't mean better. Mm. And so when you big... Yeah, you can absorb some, but when you lean and quick and fast, you got endurance because you're not carrying that big tractor trailer on your back. And the speed never goes nowhere when you're in that weight class and you still got youth. Back to that youth. You still have youth to bail you out of anything that a, a older man cannot use as a luxury. I'm going to personalize this and get Canelo Alvarez out of the equation when I ask this next question. This might hurt you. It might hurt you bad because it's going to have you salivating at the mouth just thinking about it. What would Bernard Hopkins have done against Triple G as a middleweight? I would have beat the – listen, I would – listen. Whatever it would have been, it would have been running down his leg. Boxing, spending, spanking, and sent him on home saying, what happened? Take your lesson, like I told Kelly Pavlik. Don't let this destroy you. You did, did destroy it. It did. You lectured, but, but I tried to talk to him. But I tried to do it. I'm holding on. No, no, I'm, no, I'm holding. No, 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 no. I'm holding. No, I'm holding that against you. This man, and I love Kelly Pavlik. He beat your main Taylor twice. But let me tell you something. Knocked him out. Knocked him out first go round. Decision. First time. Decision. Second time. 
He, you schooled Skelly Pavlik, and then after you schooled him, you walked the hell off across the ring and lectured him for about a half hour. Who does motivation. that? Motivation. Who does that? That wasn't motivation. He never recovered. Man, you can't do that to an opponent. You lectured him for <laughs> a half hour and while you schooled him for the, for the last 12 rounds. Who yeah. does that? I feel obligated. Oh, Lord, you're embarrassed. To, I feel obligated to say, look, oh, oh. This, is, this is bad, but... It shouldn't be over for you, but it's over. It was over because you lectured him. He never recovered because you lectured him. I got to go. Appreciate you, baby. Much love. Canelo, 12-round decision. That's what you're picking, right? Unanimous. That's what Unanimous. I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I Unanimous. Think I think he's going to win a decision.